Hello everyone. In this video we're going to work through a steady state conduction problem. And so let's say we have a room with 1000 degrees Celsius on the inside and 25 degrees Celsius on the outside and we wanted to know what the heat flux through the wall is if it's a 10 centimeter wall and the conduction coefficient is 1.31 watts per meter Kelvin. Now we can calculate this using equation 2.7 from page 34 of Drysdale's An Introduction to Combustion, where the equation is Q dot double prime is equal to negative K over L times T1 minus T2, where T1 is your hotter temperature compared to T2 is your lower temperature. So couple things to note. L needs due to the units we are given with our conduction coefficient. We know that L needs to be in meters and T needs to be in Kelvin. So we were given temperature in terms of Celsius so we're going to need to convert that which is an easy, relatively easy process. Degrees Celsius plus 273.15 equals 1273.15 Kelvin and T2 25 degrees Celsius plus 273.15 is equal to 298.15 Kelvin. So now that we have those in the right units we can plug them directly into our heat flux equation 1.31 over 0 0.01 times 1273.15 minus 298.15 and this is equal to negative 12.77 times 10 to the third watts per meter squared. I hope you have found this video uh, useful and have a good day.